Hey everyone, this is Mark from My Size Hedge Fund. We are here playing as Max with the, the new Yusuf Breaker against Titan Transnational. Uh, we're not very well geared up against fast events, but uh, we can give it a go. Opening hand is not amazing. Money. We have Progenitor though. Mm, I'll keep. Hopefully we can find, find the truth so that Mad Dash is pretty useful. And aside from that, we're just looking to get our Breakers. Other good stuff out of Max. We do have Mining Accident nice and early. They're icing up everything. And we lose Data Sugar and Levy nice and early. Okay. Let's take some money first. Let's run HQ. Let's see what we're dealing with. If we can force any sort of res, we can get Mining Accident. And then we can Career Fair Daily Cass. Nice wall. Okay, well that will stop us. But it does. Oh no, it doesn't allow that. <laughs> Whoops. Um, let's go R&D. That was silly of me. Money action would be amazing if it just didn't require a successful run. Okay. So we lose my dash. Not a big deal. One tag is fine as well. We'll take our bad pub. Next turn we can career fair Dudicas. And remove the tag, get Progenitor down, and get ourselves going. Lose a liberated and a daily cast. That is unfortunate. Draw. We'll do this one, I think. So at the moment we're just playing everything we draw. <laughs> Lose Data Sucker and Fester. Draw has not been overly kind. Mm, let's get the other daily cast out. Hold on to Paperclip for the moment, but it's one we want to get out sooner rather than later. Lose the legwork. Oh dear. Okay. Let's uh, draw one more and put down the liberated. We will discard paperclip for the moment. I would prefer that we could depend on Fester, but if we don't find these, or uh, sorry, if we could depend on Yusuf, but if we don't find it, uh, we're kind of going to have to go with the paperclip approach instead. Now we have access to quite a few breakers at least. Masselis is more annoying for Black Orchestra, though. Mm, unless we want to leave one of them fire. Or we can find Tata Sucker. And Wakua, also useful. Um, we can keep Amaku at one strength, actually, which is kind of funny. So if we can get a token on it, we can guarantee ourselves keeping it. Usually abusing this for data sucker, data sucker or Yusuf, but because they're playing Heidi's, or in data sucker's case, ending up in the heap, not all that useful. Okay, let's keep blitzing through our deck then. Hey, there we go. And I think we've been... Dirty laundry at the moment. Just because we're kind of chilling out. Not really putting on the pressure. I'd like for MK Ultra to end up in our bin. And then I feel a bit more positive about things. And there's a good chance they're going with this then. Uh, still no Ultra. They possibly feel they can stop us. 
Uh, we could be running into Hallsworth, really. But I think it's important to try. Let's uh, let's put down this just in case. Some like titanium could really hurt. David, there we go. And we had paperclip on hand as well. Uh, we'll use all of this. We could have pulled out the paperclip as well, but this seems good. We get ourselves an atlas. Plus, we get ourselves a token. So all very useful. Um, I do want to see what the ice here is. So try and get ourselves our MK Ultra, and then we'll be ready to go. Heart hitting news. But only trace four. And MK Ultra's in the bin. Good times. So let's uh Take some money. Uh, do we need a lot of money? Probably not. So same old thing, legwork. And then hopefully we'll be able to fire another mining accident off. Colossus, yep, we'll get out our MKUltra. And the power of Yusuf, we get free money, basically. Our memory is not good to us. Okay, they've got a lot of hard-hitting news going on. All the hard hitting news. Is. And let's uh, take some more money. <laughs> Mining accident was the plan, but plans have to change sometimes. Retrieve and run. At the moment, it's an expensive data sucker. Um, but maybe it's okay. I think I've it worse can go. So we need to be very careful about the old hard hitting news and all that. A lot of cards ending up in archives as well. Trope is likely too slow. So I think instead we retrieve a run, get ourselves a data sucker, liberate it so we don't end up getting hit by hard hitting news. And that should put us in an okay position, I think. Hortum. So unfortunately we'll have to... We could just let them end the run. Or we can pay three, six. Yeah, I think it's worth it. And then we can money up. At least now we know what's where as well. Which will allow us to do dirt laundry runs, uh, prepare for mining accidents, all that kind of thing. So I think dirt laundry into archives and then mining accident seems like a plan. Get ourselves a global food as well. Not bad. Let's mining excellent. And then just credit it up again. Still want to avoid the old hard hitting news. Okay, now we gotta be a bit more careful. 
So I might as well draw the last card. Find the truth. Fantastic. And now we've got a decent engine going. We have the bad pub to our name as well. Uh, the only issue is the festers are all in the bin. So this will cost us three and then a token to get in here. It's worthwhile. Especially with all the bad pubs that we're racking up piece by piece. We don't have access to Mad Dash, unfortunately. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Should have used Dash Sucker instead. Nope. Hmm, <laughs> Zapper. Uh, no, let's... This is going to be... Not amazing. Tap card is Hordum. And we can trash Sapper and end up at 8 credits, which is okay. It's not amazing. Or we can leave it there. Um, I think we leave it. And just money up. Just to be safe. So another Hortum we can deal with pretty handily. So getting in here will cost us the paperclip and an extra four credits plus whatever this is. Or alternatively, we can lower the strength of this. Just use these three. So I think we have to take a look. They may be counting on us spending a lot of money when we don't actually have to. Of course, if it's a cyberdex or something, that could cause us issues. Causes a lot of issues. Hmm. Alternatively, we can run here. Or HQ. Cyberdex is an intimidating thought at the moment. We'd lose the same old thing and these and that would be our game over. So I think instead we take a credit at the same old levy. And money. This could be an atlas which would hurt as well. But apparently it's not. Marchio. See, Cyberdex is the big fear. Um, so instead we can dirty laundry here. Reduce by one. I think that's the way to go. Boop. Preemptive, no good to us. Shipping from Tenon. Okay. Uh, let's go Fester. Fester. And Mining Accident. <laughs> or just play it safe. I think a little safer. Because if they do want to hear any news, as I'm sure they do, we need to keep things alive. They've abandoned the boom threat, it seems. And icing up HQ as well. Where are all the agendas? HQ. 
HQ does not cost us, cost us that much, so we might as well have a look. And Amakua will soon be able to take on all sorts of ice. Top is ice wall, and we see vanilla. Not exciting. So if they do want to purge here, it's going to cost them four credits. Surely that's an agenda, right? So we have a backup Yusuf, just in case. But I'm kind of inclined to just leave them off over here. The Titanium has me scared. Marcus Paddy, Cyberdex, all of them could be really, really bad. Well, we should have... I don't know if my opponent is going to be so kind. So, I'll just learn from this mistake. I think through things properly. Just see another Hortum. No, they're icing up heavily anyway. Three cards in archives, you'd have to assume none of them are agendas. But it looks like one has gone over here now. So, Amakua will now cost us two, four, and then a virus token. I'm really liking Yusuf. It's very, very handy to just be able to run through ice willy-nilly. Find the truth, still can't hit anything. Just the archive memories instead. And again, we got to continue to play safe. Make sure we don't get hard hitting news into the ground. Or if we do, we can at least bounce back and clear the four tags end up on two credits. Here's Cyberdex. So Rebirth here is actually okay as well. Go for Omer, try and get into HQ that way. We keep one on each of these, which is nice. Um, yeah, let's try that. For fun, we could run into Archives as well. Because of the May, we could cast some four credits each time. We could go Alice, which is kind of funny as well. Um, but I like Omer. Let's go for HQ. Just because we get that uh, double dip, Brian Stinson. Okay, good to know as well. Another Tetonium waiting for us. So we got to stay above six credits, which means no mining accidents. Um, but they are going to give us the concession. Um, I don't know. I don't know if we had it on lock. We were in a good position for sure, but I mean, our money wasn't flying out of out of the gates um where were all their agendas i assume they have one or two buried in here maybe because they get, did give us the global food quite early uh, any hq access wasn't really paying off for us unfortunately the legwork was it was coming but it was going to be difficult to get in there or a little more difficult until we charge these up again um but it's a fun little deck 
not incredibly quick I haven't found but uh, we're trying out so I hope you enjoyed it and uh, as always thank you very much for watching